Welcome to Qigong for Health and Vitality, the eight pieces of brocade. My name is Larry Camerata, and I am a clinical psychologist, wellness educator, and instructor of Tai Chi and Qigong. Qigong is an ancient Chinese practice of healing meditative movement and energy medicine. It's a several thousand year old practice that predates acupuncture. The word Qigong means energy cultivation. The Qigong form that I'll be teaching on this videotape is entitled The Eight Pieces of Brocade, or Ba Duan Jin in Chinese. The Eight Pieces of Brocade is regarded for its health promoting benefits and is practiced worldwide by millions of people. The Eight Pieces of Brocade consists of eight separate pieces or postures of movements that are designed to free up the body's energy so that the mind can relax, the body can also relax, and the emotions can settle. The practice of Qigong promotes deep relaxation of the body and calmness of mind. And this particular form is very accessible, very easy to follow along with. On this tape, I'll be showing you step-by-step -step instructions on the postures, and then you'll also have an opportunity to practice along with me. Regarding following the tape, after a while you may internalize the movements and practice on your own. When you're practicing on your own, to receive the greatest benefit, you may wish to practice each posture eight times and double-sided postures four times. Now some key principles of Qigong practice include rooting, which refers to allowing your feet to firmly adhere to the ground or floor as if you had suction cups on your feet, like a tree with very deep roots. In addition to rooting, relaxation is very important. I like to advocate what I call a top-down approach to relaxation. Relax your shoulders, drop your shoulders, let your energy sink lower into your body and all the way down into your feet. So rooting through the feet, relaxation from the top of your body down into the feet and into the ground is very important. And also respiration or breathing. The breath in Qigong becomes deep, calm, even, and even fine, narrow. It's not necessary to over-focus on your breath if you're a beginner. However, over time, it's very helpful to coordinate the inhalation and exhalation of your breath with the pace and the flow of the movements. Now, lastly, Remembering all of these aspects, the rooting, the respiration or the breathing, and the relaxation, very important. Bringing your mind back, making this into an essential mindfulness practice is very, very important. As I tell new students to this practice, the most important instructions are simply to relax and enjoy. When we practice Qigong, the tongue is at the roof of the mouth, gently touching behind the teeth. This connects up two major energy centers of the body from the back and the front, and it's highly regarded in the tradition to place your tongue at the roof of your mouth as you practice these movements. Thank you, and I look forward to sharing this information with you.